Soccer lovers in the Eastern Province flocked to David Kaunda Stadium in Chipata to watch soccer stars of yesteryears. The fans had the rare opportunity to see players that they used to watch on television face to face. Zambian soccer legends were captained by Clive Hachlensa, while Jack Sangala wore the armband for Malawi. Clifford Mulenga and Ignisha Siluipa scored for the Zambian side, while Jimmy Zakazaka scored the consolation goal for Malawi. The newly refurbished DK Stadium was packed. Zambian coach Patrick Pili and Malayan coach Yang Chimozi had their say after the game. The experienced players are hard. They managed to do well because of the experience. So we are very happy here in Chipata. Good reception by our brothers and sisters. With their support, we managed to win. The future is bright for Zambia. Just work hard and be disciplined. I'm sure the sky will be the, the limit. We, have, we came here to play this friendly game, uh, to help our brothers uh, celebrate and their independence. And uh, looking at the game, it was a good one and tough, but I think uh, for the others, I would say they played well and uh, they played with uh, intelligence, which I think pleased most of the people. First General Secretary Ruben Kamanga and Eastern Province First Chairperson Crispin Kamuna also watched the game. So this is in line with our administration's uh, executive. We we're trying to put people from the, from the lowest age. We we're starting with underlying, under, under, under 15 and under 17. You can see, it was a very competitive game. And thanks to the provincial administration in this province. The national team scouts to come to the province and watch the, the players in their own environment. And uh, today, I think, is the start of a good, day, a, a good period to come, where we attract more provinces to come through, indeed ourselves, to travel and interact with the provincial teams. Before the Legends game, Eastern Province Under-17 soccer team drew 2-0 with visiting Lusaka Under-17. Christopher Miti, ZNBC News, Chipata.